Alright, the next best thing. Elimination. Let's go. <laughs> oh, elimination it is. Jeez. The trick to elimination as a centurion is either kill the guy fast or don't fight. There's not much of anything else to do here. Phalanx is good. I just unlocked that one. That's what I was hoping to get. I like this build. Haymaker is really good for me because I want to make sure that my displacing stamina abilities also do damage. And I'm a huge fan of passive abilities and active ones. Wow, we have a nice mix on the team. That is a first. Looks like Centurion is the popular class this time around. Most of the time, I've been surprised that it's mostly been uh, Shinobi. So it's nice to see that the Centurion is still being represented. I was told I was playing other people yesterday, and some of them invited me to parties. And as we were talking, they mentioned that a huge reason why people probably aren't playing Centurion as much as Shinobi is, even though they're both kind of difficult to play. The Shinobi is just flashier and the Centurion. Maybe other people are seeing what I saw in the Centurion in a 1v1 scenario. Where all you got to do is sidestep, sidestep attack. Or worse, sidestep shove or push or something. But here we go. Centurion versus Centurion is a huge momentum thing. Whoever pretty much gets off that that first wave of attack is good. And uh, if you don't sidestep, you lose. Give me my t-shirt. I want my GYB t-shirt. Excellent. Oh, Lawbringer. Actually, I was going to get somebody with my Lawbringer, and surprisingly enough, um, this matchup goes in my favor a little bit.
Got him. So far, so good. If my team can just hold out, or at the very least get two guys. All right, I see. We should be good. And I see the final guy. Shit. Very nice. Damn, this Lawbringer is probably not having a good time right now.
Looks like I gotta kill my opponent faster. Round five. Well, this is gonna end one way or the other. I gotta go for it. Can't let him die. That's how you do it. Victory. Shinobi and Centurion. Fight it out. <laughs> that kills you. But yeah, again, like I don't like I I haven't gotten too much controversial shit about the video that I post about the Centurion. But let me just defend myself again. Centurion is great in Elimination and Dominion. Hands down, in my opinion. Uh, next to the Shigoki. And I haven't even seen a Shigoki since the, since the update. Uh, so, I am uh, quite happy with how he is in multiplayer modes. Uh, but as far as dueling is concerned, yeah, I just don't see it. Try dueling. Warden. All right. Oh! <laughs> 
That was actually a pretty good duel. The dude was punishing me with sidesteps, but interesting. I didn't expect this. I think maybe he's doing it too late. Hmm. He did not want it. Round three. But this is an insight. This is an interesting insight. Very interesting. Perhaps, perhaps I spoke too soon. Maybe, maybe it's only the Shinobi that can decimate me with a sidestep attack. No. Ah. This is why I'm giving him a, this is why I'm going to stick through it. You know, um, it was my first impression on the Centurion. Uh, but again, no, no, right now I'm eating my words. I'm eating my words right now. Maybe because I did duel a lot of Shinobi and all of them were essentially doing nothing but waiting for me to try to engage. And then they would, uh, they would sidestep and kick me, but yeah. Maybe I gotta just, you know, eat humble pie. I'm not humble pie because I'm not fucking on the ego horse, but I like the Centurion, but shout out to Kaiser for helping me not completely relegate this guy. Because I like everything about this guy, except for the dueling aspect. But if he has one weak matchup against the Shinobi and it's an absolute weak matchup, it is what it is. Speak of the devil. I may make this into an entire video uh, just to showcase all three aspects uh, of what I mean. So if this is on a YouTube video, sorry that this is sloppy as shit. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I think it's important to showcase all of these uh, in quick succession rather than three separate videos. I'm not trying to flood it with like small shit rather group it all together but hopefully the shinobi is smart bounced round two
can't play his game and give him pretty much a flat line of range. I need to be able to run around to be able to avoid the ranged attacks shenanigans. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting I can uh, lion's roar after a quick throw. Ah, went too late. Went too crazy on him. This Shinobi isn't sidestep, uh, double sidestep into his kick as often, but he is doing it. He is doing it. I don't know if it's enough, though. And he's not guard breaking. Uh, yeah, I can't really categorize this guy as a... Uh... Oh, he pulled me through it. Oh, he could do that. Holy shit, yo. <laughs> yo, that was sick. for the parry could do it round five Ezreal again he's got the stairs now but I've got the uh, other side I think I'll leave it there. I'll, I don't want to make this particular highlight too long, but I'll leave it there and just put it out. You know, what are people's opinions as far as a centurion and dueling? Am I eating my words? In my defense, I don't think this is the shinobi that would do nothing and then just wait for me to try to lunge at him and then sidestep kick. But I also didn't give him the chance to. I use the environment. So... I'll leave it there. Uh, shameless plug. If you do want to see what happens next, clearly this is a stream, so I post the full stream as well. So there you go, champs. I'm going to keep going. <laughs>